So if you have a Honda and it's giving you an error message check emission system, I thought I'd go over what it means, what causes it, and how you might be able to go about fixing it. And so what is this check emission system error message? Well, basically the onboard computer seeing an error with the vehicle, mainly with to do with the emissions, and so it's going to have to be troubleshooting to why. And this can be caused by a few different things. So it could be like a catalyst problem, an evap problem, or possibly an engine problem. And so the first thing to do when this happens to you is to go get an OBD2 scan tool and read the codes that's on the computer. And this is really easy to do. There's an OBD2 port on underneath the dashboard on every vehicle made after 1996, including Hondas. And you basically just plug the scan tool into that and you just read the codes. There's some really low cost OBD2 scan tools. You can get some on Amazon for like $20, $30. You can also go to automotive stores and they'll do scans for free. You might need to call around first to be sure. But most of the time, if you go to automotive stores, they'll come out and they'll scan the codes for free and they'll tell you what they are. But the first thing to do is to go read the onboard computer to see what codes is on there. So for example, if you get a P0420 code, this is going to point to a catalyst problem and you're going to know it's something to do like with the catalytic converter an oxygen sensor the wiring going to the oxygen sensor or possibly an exhaust leak and so when you know this is the problem you go take a look at it you could test the oxygen sensor there's different ways you could test for the catalytic converter or you could even run catalytic converter cleaner through it and see if it clears but you'll know basically where the problem is another example is going to be like a p1457 code which is an evap system problem and the evap system basically just takes the gas vapors from the gas tank and sends them back into the engine to get burnt off so they don't escape into the atmosphere and so this can be caused by a few things. Could be a bad gas cap because the gas cap needs a seal. Could be a bad purge valve, which is located up on top of the engine. And this is just a simple valve that opens when the engine's running to let the gas vapors in and get burnt off. And then it closes so that they don't escape. And there's also a thing called a charcoal canister underneath by the gas tank that holds the vapors when the vehicle's not running. And so if you got an EVAP code, you basically go through and check those things. You check the gas cap, test the purge valve, check out the charcoal canister, check for any leaks, and things like this. And if it's an engine problem, you get some kind of engine related code. So you might get something like a P0101 and a P0101 code is pointing towards a dirty or bad MAF sensor. And usually a MAF sensor, you just need to clean it up and it starts working again. And so what do you do if you have a Honda with the check emission system message? Basically, you need to get a scan of the onboard computer and find out which codes are on there. If you don't have an OBD2 scan tool, call around to your local auto parts stores. They'll usually do scans for free and tell you what they are. Once you know what the codes are, it'll point you to what the problem is. There's different emission systems beside the Honda. So it's very important to know this so you can go check the components that are related to that code that you get. And so that's basically it. I just wanted to make a video on what a Honda check emission system error message means and how you might be able to go about fixing it. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you. Please click like, please click subscribe and have a good day.